for a little while. Um, obviously, as you go viral, your videos will attract more comments, both positive and negative. So how do you deal with potentially increased hate comments and negative comments from them? Can I start on that one? I just ignore every one of them. I think the creators out there who uh, answer them with videos and, and answer them, it's just a losing battle. You'll never win. Um, because we know what the kids are like. Not just the kids, some mean adults as well. So just don't listen to them, ignore it and move on. It's the simplest thing. Not, I know it's not the simplest thing, but um, for me it is, but I just ignore every single one of them, personally. Yeah. For me, I'm viral. Like, I don't look at the comments because there's just so many, first of all. And second of all, what, what good am I gonna like, gain out of it? Do you know what I mean? Yes, there'll be some positive like, comments that make me happy, but then the negative was like, I just don't care. Um, you know, that's when you know you're doing something right. If people are, you know. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Dinosaur yeah. always goes viral. No, it doesn't. Honestly. But it's never really bothered me in the slightest. Um, we do it for work as well. So it's our day-to-day -day job and we just slip in the videos and they do well. Um, but you said it well. Yeah, just try something else. Never give up. Never give up. Just keep going. So would you agree that potentially going viral and not going viral for a while, that affects your mental health or has done in the past? And then what are those things that you've done to kind of combat that, get your creative buzz back, get back on track and just going forward? Um, like like I said, there was a time that I used to like get really upset, let's say, about it. And obviously it's not good. Um, it's not good for anyone. Um, but the reason we stay motivated and it doesn't affect me or Megan that much anymore is because we've learned that just because the video not, hasn't done as well doesn't mean that's your future. Like. Starts to slow down. How do you deal with that kind of stress? Down? I stress. I stress a lot. <laughs> and I know, I know, I could be here and I could be like, oh no, guys, don't stress. But honestly, like, I do. I do. I panic, and I know I shouldn't because that's so bad too. But I, I'll spend the whole day and I'll be like, right, new ideas. What can I do? Um, it almost it's a bit unhealthy, isn't it? Yeah, it it's is. not even healthy. I'm mean, like, you can't really sugarcoat it. When you start thinking, oh my god, am I flopping on? It becomes like so addictive. When really. Shouldn't be like that. Is that you're competing with yourself? <laughs> Ranger Andy is the dinosaur. Oh. So I do have a boss. You're a round of boss. I think he needs a clap. Uh, he's the other half of us, so uh, <laughs> when we get the comments all the time, I can see the legs. He's the legs. He is the legs. So, um, what was the question, sorry? Do you reckon there's a secret flaw formula for you to go viral or for somebody else to go viral? Um, a secret formula? Personally, I think there isn't. Yeah, keep them watching, make mistakes. Mistakes are good. Honestly, if you've got a mistake and people comment about that mistake, um, so don't over edit them, just get it out there. You never know what's going to go viral. Literally, anything can. One of my most virals is me just walking my fingers at the T-Rex. 100 million. Sedic sed seductively as well? No. Or? Okay. Just, just like this. And to that one that goes do, 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 all the way up. And that's it. So I don't think there's a body right now. Let's just keep it watching. Everyone wants to work out what we live. That's what it is. That's what it is. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. Right then, just finished the panel with these guys.